As we all know, fat not only provides energy in fish feed, but also provides essential fatty acid for fish growth. So choosing the right fat source and the fat level can save protein, reduce the cost, and reduce environmental pollution. Due to the resource constraints, the price of fish oil has been increasing in recent years. So feed manufacturers and fish nutrition experts are working hard to study nutritional requirements of fat for fish. Under the promise of not affecting growth, the feasibility of using other animal oil and plant oil instead of fish oil was explored. So commonly used fat sources in aquatic feed, including the fish oil, tallow, lard, coconut oil, palm oil, corn oil, and uh, soybean oil, ripseed oil, sunflower oil, and uh, linseed oil. Fish oil mainly contains uh, N3 fatty acids such as uh, DHA and the EPA. Coconut oil contains 89% saturated fatty acid, including 48% lauric acid, 17.5% muristic acid. Palm oil is an oil extract from palm fruit. The color range from dark yellow to dark red, and contains 40% palmitic acid, 41% palmitolic acid. Plant oils are highly in linoleic acid, such as soybean, corn, peanut, and uh, sunflower oil. Different kinds of fat are mainly composed of uh, different fatty acids because the ability of fish to utilize different fat in the feed is actually the ability to utilize fatty acid in the feed. At the same time, the fat in the feed in turn affects a series of reactions such as the physiological and the biochemical reaction of fish. In general, fish tend to use saturated and unsaturated fatty acid for energy, while poor fats are generally used as a functional substance and are retained in the, in the body. For example, rainbow trout use most of 16 to 0 fatty acid as energy. The fatty acid composition in the feed will affect the activity of lipids. Excessive highly unsaturated fatty acid in the feed will inhibit the activity of delta-6 desaturase, uh, resulting in the inhibition of uh, the conversion of linoleic acid to ARA and the feed with low unsaturated fatty acid feed increase delta-5 and delta-6 desaturase activity. Different kinds of fat have different uh, fatty acid compositions and the fish has different uh, capacity to digestion and absorption. With the rise of the fat level in the feed, the digestion of the Atlantic salmon to fat increase and the protein digestion rate increase with the increase the content of plant oil in the feed. For fish, the utilization rate of fish oil is high and the utilization rate of lard and plant oil is low. Different kinds of fat in the feed will significantly affect the HSI and the fat of the fish, which will affect composition of fish body. The fat source of the feed has the greatest effect on the content of body fat and water, and the following is the content of protein and ash, such as rainbow trout, Atlantic salmon, and so on. Fatty acid in fish muscles 
liver and uh, adipose tissue are directly affected by composition of fatty acid in the feed. To some extent, it reflects the composition of fatty acids in the feed. Generally speaking, replacing fish oil with uh, plant oil will reduce the content of EPA and the DHA in the body. In conclusion, the replacement of fish oil with plant oil will be a hot topic in future. Rational use of plant oil will be helpful for the sustainable development of the world aquaculture.